shut down this Faramis early, early on. Last pick. It's a Florin! We were talking about how Evos have banned out the <laughs> Florin against Aura. Why did they do that? Why did they ban the Grot? Why did they ban the Cho? Yowie, of all people. Yowie, ladies and gentlemen, the guy we know for the initiative. Aware that he's going to be jumped on very, very aggressively in the middle of these big fights. Kabuki, though, with a weakness finder and Master Assassin. Like, I think a lot of ganks are going to be thrown by Aura to the side of the goal Lois Key caught in No Man's Land. He is going to be next to the Ooh. chopping block, I guess. But the backup is here from Lou. Oh! It goes forward. The first blood is there for him. Yeah, skill is very low, but they flee away from the crime scene. He definitely have an advantage. And always a lot more active making the first move. The tunnels will come. We'll walk it down. CC immune as well as their real manipulation is there for a boy. He's going to get the kill towards Gugun. Turtle is next on the menu for Geek Fam. As the players of Aura, they are fleeing away. It is very hard for them to even lay claim on this turtle. It is solely and has setting up. And now again, Voloisky. Gugun, you're in the wrong neighborhood. Yowie is going to be able to flicker away, but the blazing duet is there. Gugun with that taunt will be able to lock them down in place. Ray gets Yowie. Kabuki jumps forward with the Lycan Pound. Not going to be able to get anyone in that process, though. Luke is taunted forward. He wants to run away. Voloisky is still there, shadowing oh. his teammates. But the kill from Ray is going to connect. Kabuki jumps forward. He is going to what? be taken down with the tone as well. Come around, it's late to rescue his teammate. Yaoi, the full on brawl, will help forward towards Aran. The shutdown is there for Ray, but Luke is next, trying to eat up the red dragons. And Yaoi, not able to save his teammates. Geek Fab. The Roger against the Claw as well, but they weren't able to utilize it. Now, another shortcut. Oh, he's giving the shortcut, is gonna hitchhike Ray towards the crime scene. Good, good. He is dead again in the hands of Aloyski. Now they are pouncing forward. The Tunnels welcome towards the players of Aura. Yaoi lock in play. Silence as well for Yeheskiel. Popped up the Nettle but it's not gonna save oh. him. He, it is going to save him. Kabuki gets Luke. A one for one trade. Aran hiding in the book. To make the move. If Aura continue to react, they're gonna be in trouble. Jump forward. Aran. Dumping towards the back line, and it is going to force Jira to flee. Boloyski still again in the midst of it all. Will be able to push them back. It is now Geek Fam wow. looking to abort, but Gogun, he gets the turtle again. Mr. Neutral up against the Ray Tribution. But still, he made it work and he got the purple! Meanwhile, we've got another brawl. Aran misses the final slash. The real world manipulation will not be able to get anything. Kabuki now joins Whoa. the fight. Oh boy, he is very low, but it is not enough to become Whoa. a face of Kabuki! He is gonna like it bounce towards the back line. A boy is dead. He is. Do you so? But Geek, they want to try and go for a siege or a dive here. Jump again. The siege under the turret. They get Gugun in place. The Tona's welcome will be there trying to take down the oh. juggler. But the good engage coming in from Aura. They're trying to prolong this fight. The blazing duet from Chadera will catch Aran in that process. Ray is there, but now it's oh. Kabuki's time to roar. He gets Luke. He will try to run away. Like and bounce. It's not going to be enough as a Geek Fam corral around Kabuki. A three for one trade so far. Not worth it for Aura East Coast. Not at all. Three for one. He's trying to make it to playoffs. Another shortcut. Another portal. Another fight. Shortcut galore. Go go and delete it. Chadera will be the executor towards that kill as they just usher their minions, usher the players of Geek Fab towards the base. Let's talk about that late game. Are Aura playing for that late game? A big team fight. Is a freaking going in all in or are Ron oh making no. a big final slash happen? Face check. Beloisky, of course, calls his oh. friends. The final slash will not Beloisky towards the back line, but a boy will get the kill towards Yaoi. The blazing duet is enough to commit the damage, and Ray will be taking. Yes, kill with him to the kill board. And of course, the kills means that they're able to even open up huger horizons to take down the crystal. A two for one, but it's technically one for one because the Faramis can respawn instantly. Aura with the defense. He will be able to hold down the line, but no, the Lord will march forward. But Geek Fam, they don't want to be trigger happy. They don't want to be too rushed. In their decisions, the Appraisal's Wrath will try to clear out the minions, but it is not going to be enough as Geek Fam able to get the last turret at the base. Great siege for Geek Fam, the opposite for Aura, a brawling comp.
They can't withstand the siege from Geek Fam. They have the front line, they have the back line, and they have a diving chip. Go, go, on, pull back. He is going to be safe with Nether Rail, but the final Ooh. slash from Arad. It is going to be there. Chadera runs away with the blazing duet, not connecting to anyone. The Tonos Welcome will lock Arad in place and kill him. Meanwhile, Yaoi and Kabuki left to look at their dead teammates. Could this be the final push for Geek Fam? But Aura Esports, I don't think they will let that happen as they will try to push them away. In combination with the Yeep, just way too much, and Ray just storms forward. Ray too curious, but Valoisky again just initiating the fight. The Tonos welcome, locked in towards Aran. Again, the next member down. They're just evaporating. Aura Esports, wings clip. Where will they fly? Of course, towards their base as Geek Fam. They'll try to look for the end, but yes, skill is the Soul Guardian with Kabuki jumping in. Locked down by Chatera. The Crystal is down. And Geek Fam, a dominating win with the playoffs in their hands. They will not go quietly into that dying night. Another step further for Aura to make it to playoffs. And technically, another step closer to not being in the playoffs. Specific scenarios need to happen for Aura not to make it to playoffs. But if this is how today unfolds, if Geek Fam utilizes moments, you want a death to this welcome? You want the I'm offended? No, they go for the Yuzong. That means the Ruby will be roaming. It's Baloy on his signature offensive, no, offended pick. Yeah. Well, of course. But the question now for Aura is that yes, they have damage output, but do they have the lockdown necessary? To keep the players of Geek Fam in place. I mean, they have the talk. Really helps him boost utility of his teammates as well. But now, the turtle is going to be the subject of taking. Oh, Loisky. Uh, he fails it. But the taunt now from Gogun. The Black Dragon Four Mister Yaoi channels his heart guard to protect the players of Aura Esports. Again, a change oh. in Nether Realm will be there. The taunt again towards Luke. Luke will be able to run away from that altercation. But a boy. Steps forward with the Shadow Stampede, will not be able to take any of the members of Aura. Again, a stalemate in this turtle dance for both teams. The battle of sustain is still happening, Bloy! A pull towards Gugun! Gugun will be oh. the he won't! The appraisal's wrath is there, and the damage follow-up comes through! Kabuki looking to get his fangs on the backs of Geek Fam! And Aura Esports, they chase down a boy next on the chopping block. Gugun will be able to get the turtle, no he won't. Next if Ray's behind, and Gugun wants to go for more. Wait, is this too greedy? He could be overcommitting this, but the heart guard will save him. Re-engaging towards Luke. The appraiser's wrath is there. Last insanity. The damage comes through. But the Netherlands will save him. The, the blazing wet from Chadera towards the back line. No, it forces them back. Luke on a sliver of HP. And they disengage as Aura is going. Go for these trays like we just saw earlier. Oh, like right now. Whoa. With a pull and what? the kill. Chadera gets the has kill with the help of the Blazing Duet. But their Blazer's Wrath is there from Gugun. Again, okay. popping up Nether Realm from a boy. They will sustain the damage, but Kabuki with the mega kill. He is hungry. They're just Predator in the building. And Aura again oh. bouncing forward with Kabuki. Geek fam, we're testing their limits, oh. and their limit is Kabuki. But Kabuki might bit off more than he could chew, he won't. He will push Catch back anyone. And Aura, they're just playing the waiting game. This could be the oh. next objective being contested. Black Dragon form popped up now. Gugun, the subject of that take, and he will jump to the Lord Pit. But again, the Netherrealm oh, is there to save him. The Heart Guard will equip him again and just sustain the players of Aura. But Ray Tribution is there to get the Lord. Kabuki gets the kill. So does Gugun. And Luke, stuck in a rock and a hard place, oh. will jump forward with the Petrify. Flickers away from Aura. Oh. And Gugun, double kill secured Aura. Double digit kills, but they play from Aura though, sending mm -hmm. the Angela. Probably gonna get a neutral objective here. Geek might be forced to try and go for a bit of a pickoff. Four items in the inventory of Chidera. He has a win of nature as well, so he has a lot of damage. Can he output it in time though? BDF popped up, and the Tonas welcome towards Iran. Will he be the next main oh! Rage Rain Tribution strikes a 
again. But the, now the Black Dragon form has been gone in the realm, popped up, and Tadero is able to escape, but Loth oh. dead in the hands of the appraiser's wrath. And the last insanity will look for a boy fishing him down. And again, Kabuki oh. jumping in. An angry werewolf is in the building, and that werewolf is Kabuki Aura. Losing the Lord, but winning the kills. You Stop made for Aura, but can you take a look at the gold lead? And it's a one, it's 1,700, oh. Aran! Oh, oh, Aran pulled into the chaotic team that is Geek Fam. But that's just a taunt. Send a message towards Aura to be careful approaching this Lord pit. Oh man, that's an, his entire Viraga armor mm -hmm. taken out. He's, he will be able to get that back, obviously. You can just burn some of these creeps in the jungle, but... Back to the point that I was making, 14-3, to 2,000 gold lead only by Aura. This is, if you wanted to say what game reflects Geek Fam the best, this is probably it! Uh-oh, BDF now towards the backline, Shadera just Shadera. spinning around with the blazing duet! But the hard oh. is there, Arad gets Ray, the backline though, Gugun gets another kill as well, Avoy is very low, he is gonna be chopped down, he won't, he's still surviving! But legendary for Kabuki, Shadera is able to oh. run away, no he won't, a wipeout! as the red flaming dragons spew out their flames. The dragon beaten down to the ground with no wings left clipped down, but they flame through. They're gonna go for it. This is the end, the crystal next on their eyes. A boy just evaporate and Aura Esports take flight. Not in the skies, but they're slowly ascending. Game three, next in the cards. The tip of the spear, Chadera, got melted down by the flames of the dragons. Kabuki was a bait, he was a bait. Aran dealt more damage towards the end in the fight. And with Chadera focusing down on Kabuki with the help of the hard guard, the flames melted through every... Yeah, that's why, I mean, we were talking about how Kabuki can dodge away from the Iron Defend is the Iron Bones, but one thing you cannot dodge... Oh! oh! It's a signature Yehezkiel pick! Something that we saw in the challenge season for Yehezkiel just last year. Popped off on this pick, carried. We were talking about how the range could work out. That's why the Novaria was there. Trying to capitalize on it. Luke! Oh no, the movement though! Wow. And Aran is just deleted. First blood for Geek Fam and for Luke. And next, of course, in their menu oh. is the turtle. He has Kiel in the bush looking to make a play. But of course, the Eternal Guard will oh. lock him in place. And the hook just sends him swinging towards the back. But the air strike will not connect. Might that be a misclick? But the Brazers wrath from Gogun. You really need to be careful about Geek Fam, right? They have the better pick off once again in the mid lane. Yeah, has Kiel. No, he's just going to die. And what? for what? Oh no, a blind hook from Beloisky will catch Gugun, but that signals him to move forward. A run in the back line, oh now the appraiser's run is there, the damage is just enough. Circling Eagle from Yaoi will keep Luke in place. BDF counter from Aran will be able to usher Geek Fam for a kill. Aura. On it, Ray though, wants to look for it too, both posturing over. Oh, shield unity, just rolling him around. Another Turtle Dance, who will be the champions of this. Yaoi oh. in the back line, the Eternal Guard is there, and Zaman Force is perfect. Oh. But the Feather Air Strike will be able to snipe someone down. Now it's Chadera. It is going to kill Goku and double kill for Chadera. The Iron Hook connects, Aran stuck and unable to move. A triple kill for Chadera, and this Herit is online. Oh no! What's worse than a Harris? Well, though, and that's a Sky Guardian helmet rush, it seems. Luke! A pull towards Yaskiel again, locked in place! Oh. Collapsed upon, and the chain CC is perfect. Kabuki with the blazing duet, no damage. Jawi again, the circling eagle, and oh. Aran, defensive BDF, will not save him from the disaster. And that disaster is Chadera. Chadera pulled him out of the skies, he shot him from the skies. Dropped down to the ground, Beloy! Oh. Oh. 
basic attack base. In theory, it should kind of play out like that, but still, it's a small difference. Chadera could be caught to the shield. Is there though? Feathered airstrike from behind. Chadera is able to bob Aran. and weave from the damage, but Iran circling around the players oh. of Aura. Perfect eternal guard, but it won't really hit anyone. Ray is oh. low, but Iran gets a boy, and he has to be the sacrificial lamb. Ray rolls away from the crime scene. It's a one for one trade. A boy for Iran. Who's it worth for? Oh, they go oh, to the Loiski again! Fishing for Yeheskel! He's delated! And Gogo -Go next on the jumping board. It is disaster after disaster for, for Chadera. Uh oh. Anyone that gets caught will get bursted down. Conceal play from Beloisky. Oh. Thankfully, though, it misses. Good, good. Now jumping in the back line. Zaman Force popped up. Yes, with the ultimate. Now Yaoi gets Beloisky. This could be the turnaround. No, it isn't. Because Chadera is just an absolute beast Wait, in the what? back line. But the Petrify! Chadera is dead. But where is the damage? Where's the follow up? Aura, though. They choose to disengage. And that is a huge shutdown towards Chadera. They're happy with it. They've taken oh, on Chadera. But for Aura, they have their sights on one guy, Luke! Oh, what a pull towards Goku, oh, he is deleted! A boy gets the kill, and no jungler for this Lord fight. This is just trouble for Yowie? Aura Esports. Yaoi circling eagle towards the back line, Chandera chases him down. The airstrike is there, the Lord! Of oh. course it is secured by Retribution. And Kabuki with the run, and Yaskel running for the hills. Oh. Kabuki forces the blazing duet, but he's caught in the middle of a gunfight. And Geek Fam steamroll. The players of Aura, the dragons, they pull them down. No ascension towards the sky. They're still trying desperately to hold on. Arad goes for a desperate engage. The petrified towards Luke. Will it be enough? No, it won't be. But the crystal is next on the menu. It's next on their eyes. The Lord is there to try to clear that crystal down, but too many members of Geek Fam in the back line. This could be it! The dragons are slain! Geek Fam! They pull them down, clip their wings, and slay them. The gatekeepers! Geek Fam will deny that playoff spot for now. Aura have another chance in their next match. One last chance, one last hope remains for the Dragons. As they have been beaten down, battered on the ground by the Geeks.